There are now many fields of science that are also realizing a need to embrace this perspective. Indeed, many scientists are at last realizing that it is only by embracing a spiritual understanding and then applying it to science that any true answers will ever be found. For example, mainstream science is now openly declaring that consciousness is non-local to the body. And this is also extremely significant. For what this means is that what you see when you look in the mirror is not actually you. It is merely the vessel that you use as a tool to create and experience your chosen reality. For the real truth is that the world in which you live is purely illusionary. It is nothing more than a construction of your beliefs, your perceptions and your intentions. A creation of your understanding and your conditioning. And it is these things that confuse you into believing that what you perceive in the mirror is who and what you are and it controls what you think you can and cannot achieve. They also convince you that what you perceive and experience as the solid world around you is real, even though it is purely an illusion you are experiencing. What is required to gain an understanding of your true nature and of the power you hold on a personal level is to gain an understanding of energy and to be aware of what type of energy you are centered in. Everything that exists is simply energy in differing forms of perception. Everything is energy. It is this energy that makes up this reality. What you perceive around you as vacuum and empty space is the true stuff of the universe. What you perceive as a solid world around you, the things you perceive as matter are in reality simply divisions in space. It is the space that is truly real. What arranges the substance of this space into discernible matter is consciousness. The conscious energy field around you has been called many things by many people. It has been called the matrix, the mind of God, nature, or even simply the field. It is the intangible stuff that connects all things and binds them into a single reality. It is this field that each of you is connected to and with which you interact to create and shape reality every moment of every day. This is achieved via your perceptions and through the interactions of your thoughts, your feelings, and your emotions, for these things that occur within you are quite literally a language. And this language, though not spoken, is very real. The importance of understanding this language has been known since ancient times. Many societies of the past based their entire civilizations upon gaining this understanding. And it was solely for this purpose that many of their now ancient structures were created. Many of these ancient remains were not merely temples, they were places of learning. The key to comprehending such places is to understand how energy works and how different energies are affected by different types of geometry. A structure would be built according to certain sacred geometric principles in order to create certain frequencies within the individual. The building itself would then generate a specific type of energy field that would be perceived by anyone entering inside as a tangible feeling or emotion within them. The walls and ceilings of these places would then be adorned with information in the form of hieroglyphs, texts and zodiac references that to the layman would simply seem like interesting stories, but to the initiated would explain the energy and the feeling generated by the structure what this type of energy truly was and how it could be understood, harnessed and spoken. Each of these structures served in essence as a book enabling the student to understand and speak the language of feeling and emotion. This language is still used and is still spoken by people in the modern world today 
In fact, it is spoken every single moment of every single day by every human being on earth, though most are completely unaware that they are doing so. It is the language of electromagnetism spoken to the surrounding energy field via the liquid crystal oscillator that powers your body. It is the language of the heart. There are, however, certain forces in this world that have worked to ensure such information is kept out of public knowledge. And this is most especially true in our modern societies where the powers that be have painstakingly attempted to keep such knowledge well hidden. These forces have succeeded in trapping the collective consciousness of humankind within one small layer of a fractal and endless reality. And this has been achieved via the manipulation of mind. Methods have been employed that have succeeded in completely detaching human beings from their sense of power and reality. And this is a process that has been going on for a very long time. It has been done through the suppression of true knowledge and by using such machinations as religion, patriotism, race, wealth, class and every other form of separatism available in order to create a divided mindset among the people. Anything to make humankind feel separated from each other and from the planet they live upon. And the main tool that has been used to achieve these ends is fear.